The Trail 125 is a really cool bike. It's got a lot of neat little features. It's, um, it's my utility bike. I, I use this bike almost every day around the house doing chores, everything from carrying stuff on the rack to going out and fetching my trash bins out from the road. Uh, we're talking about like a couple hundred feet radius is the acre of land that I live on. And um, this bike is super useful to me within this little tiny area. So I um, immediately thought of, man, how can I make this bike more useful? Like what kind of little trinkets and things that I have that I can add onto it that will make it even more useful, right? So I went on the Japanese websites, We Bike and Bees Deals, because we don't have too many accessory shops, if any, here in the United States for these bikes just yet. So the only place to really get stuff is from the Asian market. So with that, I went and started looking at some of the little um, accessories for the bike. And I found some pretty cool stuff. Um, one of them is on there already. It's the, the Moto Skill center rack that you can kind of see. I'm going to have a separate video on that. And the other things that I found were um, just like little handy things. And uh, what I decided to pick up, because shipping is so expensive, um, was uh, this Kitako, uh, I believe it's called like a multi-purpose bar. Yeah, the Kitako multi-purpose bar. It goes over the handlebar mount and it provides like a little um, grab bar. That's what I'm thinking I'm going to use it for, actually for my kids because the kids ride in the middle and that's why I got the center rack. They ride in front of me and they put their feet on the center rack but the handlebars are kind of big and wide and there's lights and everything mounted to them so it's hard for them to grab onto something. So my idea was to put this center bar right there in the middle so they can kind of grab onto it and be like a, a middle passenger seat. So I know that's probably not the way Honda intended this bike to be used and um, I appreciate everybody's concern about safety of the kids, but um, we're not going out on highways like this. We're riding around the yard and stuff, so all is good. I've unpacked it a little bit here, and this is how it comes. It's just the bar and, and the hardware. This is a Kitako brand, so it's, it's a well-known name brand, and um, it's pretty sturdy, pretty heavy. It looks pretty simple. That's it, that was pretty simple. Um, the most challenging part, I feel, is just um, breaking loose the hex head bolts that hold the handlebar clamp down. And I still don't have T-handles, but I think that job would be a little bit too tough for a T-handle anyways. So if you don't have a socket-based hex head Allen key sort of setup, um, you can just put a cheater bar on the regular Allen key like I did. And you can break it loose fairly easily. So. Uh, Pretty cool little thing. I sat my youngest Callan up there ready and he was, everything was right there. It was almost like a little stroller, you know, like he was sitting in a nice little position holding on to that bar. And I know that's not what it's designed for. It's designed for putting like a cup holder or a cell phone mount on there. And I, I put the cup holder on there just to show you how you can mount stuff to it. But I actually moved the cup holder back to the handlebar and centered over 
the um, new bar. Just um, it's packaged a little bit more neatly, and the top of that bar assembly is a little bit ugly. Uh, it's just got silver Allen key bolts instead of the nice, you know, recessed finished bolts of the uh, OEM clamp. So um, putting the uh, factory plastic little finish caps on there helped a little bit, but throwing that cup holder over that whole assembly kind of just hit it from uh, view anyway. So that's what I ended up settling on. And we're going to go out and test this out and put it to use and probably drop back in and tell you how that worked out. So that's going to be it. Thanks for watching. I hope this helps you out in uh, customizing your trail and the handlebar mount hack. Hopefully that uh, helps you taller riders get a little bit more room like myself. And other than that, I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one.